I'm again um, honored to be part of the scientific advisory board of the IMF. I think it's again going to play a very important role in setting the stage of future research that the IMF, the IMWG uh, will be doing. Again, you know, we have different organizations, but we all working towards the same goal of making myeloma not a problem anymore uh, in making sure our patients are living their full life. And I think the major goal for the scientific advisory board is to set the agenda, identify the priority problems that we need to focus on, and also identify which among those should be the focus of the IMF activities. Obviously, there are lots of different things that need to be addressed, and we don't need to be addressing every one of them, as you know, there are different organizations that are trying to address different problems. And so we can, again, focus on where we are the best at addressing and which problems and identify those and then decide what is the strategy to address the problem. So is it a clinical trial like the ASAN trial we talked about? Is it a screening study like the ISTOP MM study that was done as part of the Black Swan project? Or is it trying to understand why some patients with myeloma live long term with very minimal treatment? Some of those exceptional responders to the initial therapy. Understanding the biology of that might give us some clues as to how we may be able to cure this in a more reliable fashion for some of those patients.